Hi, this is Allison Sheridan, and welcome to another edition of Screencast Online. If you're often in the position of needing to teach friends, family, or coworkers how to perform functions on their Macs or PCs, you know how powerful sending screenshots can be to helping them understand. Annotating screenshots can make them even more powerful. On the Mac, we have a lot of screenshot tools, including the built-in capabilities, and there are tools to annotate them, including Preview. These tools work just fine for a single screenshot situation, but often the guide you're creating needs to be more involved using multiple screenshots and maybe written explanations of those screenshots. At this point, you might turn to Keynote or PowerPoint or Pages or Word to assemble the text and screenshots into a guide, but this is the road to misery. You'll spend a great deal of time faffing about with aligning images, trying to annotate your screenshots, and formatting your text. There's nothing wrong with these tools, they're just the wrong tools for the job. A much better solution is to use the dedicated step guides tool, Folga, from folga.me. With Folga, you can take screenshots and rapid fire as you go through the process and then it assembles the images in sequence for you. With powerful annotation tools, like the ability to blur information that you don't want to share in your steps to the ability to add numbered steps within your screenshot, you can rapidly and consistently annotate the screenshots to make them clear. The text tools are also very powerful, but perhaps the most powerful part of Folga is how it exports your guides nicely formatted so you don't spend any time trying to get an image to show up on the same page with its associated text. Unlike so many applications these days, Folga is not a subscription. It's not inexpensive at 60 euro or $70 US, but this is a lifetime license including all upcoming premium features. If you're always trying to help others, or even if you just need to write guides for yourself to remember complex processes, then that's a small price to pay for the time and energy and anguish you'll save. Folga also has a free version where you can create up to three guides that you can export to PDF with a watermark, so you can really get a feel for whether it solves a problem for you before you buy. You might be wondering about the name Folga. It turns out Folga Mia is German for follow me, like you would follow a guide. And that's why they use the logo of a follow me car. Folga has a rather interesting interface. It's not like anything else I've ever seen. It works really well but it's not traditional. When we first open the app, we see three options here, My Guides, Settings, or Quit Folga. Down here, you can see we can do our guides in English, German, or French. I'm gonna come back to guides in a minute, but let's take a quick look at settings. The first tab is all about capturing, and it's gonna be hard to explain why these are so important until we actually take some screenshots. So I'm gonna come back to this screen and we'll probably come back fairly quickly. We can also set hotkeys, and there are some application-specific options. Go back to capturing, I'll close settings, and we're right back to the opening screen for Folga. Let's go into My Guides. Now let me resize this window here with the hotkey I've set up. This is the area where you're going to see the list of all of the guides that you've created. Right now, we don't have any guides yet, so we're being given a giant Create Guide button. Before we go into that, let me explain a little bit about this interface. In the upper left here, we can create a new folder, so as you get a lot of guides, it might be helpful to organize them. Up in the upper left, we have a menu button, and this allows us to create a new guide. We can get back to our settings. Ukrainian developer Oleksi is the most enthusiastic developer I've ever met when it comes to taking suggestions. He's incorporated a lot of ideas I've had, and the application is fairly new, so if you have ideas of what you'd like to see it do, please be sure to suggest a feature. You can get to the online help manuals here, check for update, and you can directly email support right here. Now, I said that right here you could get to settings. Let me hit the X. If we actually hit the red button in Folga, we are taken directly back to here to our opening page. We could get to settings that way. Let's go back into my guides. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new up to date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone. 
and even your Apple TV using the Members Only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencasts Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, visit screencastsonline.com today and become a Screencast Online member.